Time now to meet Ada. Ada stands for Attention, Interest, Desire, Action. And that used to be a structure used by salespeople face to face. To be honest, it doesn't really work in today's environment, but it does work when selling off the page. Selling off the page, you've only a few seconds to grab attention before people move on. So your opening headline is all about capturing attention. Once they've read that opener, you again have got only seconds to develop initial attention into real interest. Hmm, I must see what this is all about. This buys you a little more time to arouse desire for whatever it is you're offering, enough to encourage action asking for it. Let me show you uh, a real life example uh, that first had phenomenal success 20 years ago and we've been repeating the process over and over again ever since. It involved a young software house that developed a package to do back office accounting, the, the company books. It was priced high and aimed at companies with a turnover of more than 70 million. So the decision makers would all be main board directors, chief financial officers. The campaign was aimed at the 5,000 largest corporations in the UK. And at that time, that was companies with a turnover uh, of, of more than 70 million. A fiercely competitive marketplace a marketplace that's heavily pestered by junk mail and mail shots. I persuaded them that they didn't really need a sales letter at all. What they really wanted was more prospects. And no one buys a $100,000 software solution off the page. So our objective should be to get those chief financial officers who knew that they'd be in the marketplace in the next 12 months or so to contact us. To, to put up their hand and say, hey, you know, I'm going to be in the market very soon. A letter, an email, a web page asking, are you in the marketplace? Uh, if so, contact us, uh, will get an almost zero response. So instead, our pitch was to sell a survival guide for free. A guide that would tell them everything they needed to know to be sure they were making the right decision. And this is what it looks like. See how we use the ADA approach? The headline, Evaluating Financial Accounting Software. Headlines do not have to be clever they do not have to be witty. They don't have to be punchy. What they need is to have resonance. Anyone making a major decision about replacing their core accounting systems in a large organization will be very aware of the importance of making the right decision. So in this instance, this headline captured attention. Interest. If so, don't talk to anyone, including us, until you've seen our free evaluation guide. Hmm, might be useful. It's not a sales pitch. It is 46 pages jam-packed with practical guidelines you could adopt when evaluating a different software option. Yes, I am interested. Desire. You could even use it to develop your software strategy. It will almost certainly contain information you will not have had the time to research or evaluate for yourself. Yes, I want it. Action. In this case, the call to action was a simple coupon. Did it work? Over 1,700 made board CFOs of the 5,000 largest companies in the UK went to the trouble of filling in and returning the coupon. 
Yes, it worked, uh, and it still does. These are the results from a recent campaign uh, in other sectors. Food sector, 19% response rate. Legal sector, 25% response from senior partners of top law firms. Clinical trials, 18% response from the, from the world's pharmaceutical companies. Security, 17% response. Shipping uh, and freight, over 20% response. Remember, our objective uh, was not to try to sell a $100,000 solution off the page. It was to sell the idea that decision makers should contact us. And as you saw, we used ADA. But did you also notice how we used emotion as a trigger for desire. 46 pages. Fear. God, what on earth have I missed? I couldn't possibly think of uh, 46 pages worth. Almost certainly contains information you won't have had the time or resources to research for yourself. That reinforces the fear. Use it to develop your software strategy. Laziness. Use it as a discussion document with your colleagues. An opportunity to shine in front of my peers. Self-esteem.